Hello everyone, today we're going to talk about how to take a table like a CSV file or an Excel spreadsheet and convert uh, latitudes and longitudes into a point feature class. So I've got a project created, I've got a map in my project, I'm just going to check the coordinate system for my current map. Um, I will probably use something else like a, uh, this is Calgary data, so I'll use a, a 3TM coordinate system, set that, and uh, now I'm ready to bring in some table information. So. If we take a look at the information I'm looking to import, I've got a CSV file that contains latitudes and longitudes of the traffic signals in Calgary. And you'll notice that I've got a couple of columns here that I'm going to focus on. Uh, one is the latitude and one is the longitude. So these are the coordinates I want ArcGIS Pro to plot and convert into points on my map. So I'm going to make sure I take a note of the column headers here and then I can close this down and the first thing I'll want to do is import that table into my file geo database. So I'll right click on my file geo database, go import, and that is going to be a table. In this case I only have one, so I'll use the single table option here and I'll browse out for that uh, information. So once I have that located, I'll go ahead and select it and say OK and give it an output name. I'll call this traffic signals and import. So I'll hit that run button, wait for it to import. Looks like everything worked correctly and I'll just check that in my file geo database. So I've got uh, a table here of traffic signals and if you uh, would like to review some of the uh, properties of that table you can go ahead and check that out uh, through the properties box. So what I'll want to do is uh, drag it into my map if it's not already there. So there it is. Now uh, right now it's just a table so I want to take those uh, latitude and longitude columns and convert those into XY data. So I'll simply right click on that table and I'll go display XY data and that'll bring up my XY table to point uh, processing tool so the input table will be the one that you selected uh, you can give it a name if you want you can change this name if you want uh, traffic signal points or something like that now this is the important part here the X and the Y field so because ArcGIS has uh, some intelligence to it, it notes that uh, there's a column that's called longitude. It'll use that as the X field. And it has a, sees a column that's called latitude. It'll use that as the Y field. But note that uh, your fields in the table do not have to be called that. So even if in your table, these two columns were named something else, uh, you would just map that manually, okay? So once you've got that set up, uh, if you've got a Z field, add that in there. The coordinate system here should be left to be the native coordinate system of the data. So if you take a look at your table and you see that those columns, the latitudes and longitudes, are in WGS 1984 coordinate system, then that's what this should be set for. This is the native coordinate system of the file you're importing. So it'll take this coordinate system here, when it imports the points, it'll convert it into the coordinate system, transform that into the coordinate system of the map. So go ahead and click Run, and what that should do is generate some points uh, using the latitudes and longitudes. So now I've got an actual feature class called Traffic Signal Points. And here you can go into the Attribute table and it'll show me all that same information that we've got there. So that's how you can import some uh, uh, table and convert that into a point feature class. Thanks for watching. Bye now.